So the BAFTAs were on Sunday, but there's still a lot of looks that I didn't get to, so I'm gonna share them now. So the red carpet definitely had a lot of futuristic looks, this being one of them. This is Sheila Adam, but I cannot get over that necklace. Jamie Lee Curtis, the look feels a little bare for me. I just feel like it's missing something. Lashana Lynch giving us a moment in this beautiful baby blue gown. Okay, Vera Wang, and I'm not feeling the bandeau like underneath this slip gown because I think the slip gown would have looked so beautiful had it just been on the shoulder and kind of draping off a little bit, but I don't know, the bandeau just kind of threw me off. Madeline Arthur and Gian Battista Valli, the gown is giving very delicate, very dainty. Wallace Day, and again, Futuristic was in. I kind of love this dress and kind of the illusion that it gives. Nicola Coughlin in this beautiful Valentino gown. I, You know what? I like floral. I kind of like the subtleness of this floral print. I'm, I don't know. I'm kind of into it. Emma Thompson, and you know what? I love a good pantsuit on the red carpet, but I just wish she was wearing like a pump or a nice heel. I don't know. The shoes are kind of throwing me off. Rami Malek, I mean, you can't go wrong with a black suit. Jerry Hallowell, the gown is beautiful. The jewels are beautiful. I just wish she was standing a little more upright. I absolutely love Emma Mackey, but I feel like when you have a gown like this that's covering everything, you just want to put all of your hair back just so you can show your beautiful face. I just feel like she's hiding underneath everything. Now this was elegant. Sarah Sampaio, I thought she killed this look. And Allie Goldine has really stepped up her red carpet game. She looks fabulous. Be sure to come back for some after party looks. And also don't forget to share your fave. Let's chat in the comments.